What's up guys, it's iWinning, back with another video. Today's video we're going to be going over a cover 3 beater out of the bunch tight end. It's going to be out of stick. What we're going to do is go against uh, random cover 3. So if you guys are new to my channel, if you haven't subscribed, uh, please take the time to subscribe now. Give me a thumbs up on this video if you do enjoy it. Comment below if you want to interact with me. Now, what we can do out of this play, the only thing really you're going to need is a uh, slot apprentice in uh, the first slot closest to the line and what we're going to be able to do is kind of like kind of mimic what we do at a bunch and uh, with corner strike or pat sale so uh, to set the play up you can either block the running back or put them on an out route or an in route whatever way I'll show you later what an out route to the right does so if, from there we're going to streak the tight end what that's going to do is it's going to occupy the middle third going from right to left or left to right so from there I like to put circle on a, on, that's why I like having a slot apprentice there, is uh, I like to put him on a post. So what that's going to do is he, it's going to give you an option to take the user, uh, you know, he's in usually either you're going to use her in the middle of the field and it's going to, he's going to be able to go cover, he's going to want to cover the post because it's going to get over any, any zone going to the right. But from there, uh, you're just going to fade triangle or Y on Xbox and then you're going to motion out the corner route which is a stock corner it's which is a really good corner route it's on the you know out of the play called stick so you're going to see he's stock on a corner route going out left so you're going to motion him out a couple steps and hike it this, this play works best when you run it to the numbers so i mean if you run it to the right hash mark going to the left left to right flip the play so you know whatever i like to run my bunch tight end going uh when i do this kind of play to the wide side so uh like i said just put circle on a post put X on a streak and then triangle on a fade and then you're gonna motion out square and you're gonna hike it when he gets to the numbers what's that's gonna do is it's gonna pull that deep blue down and you're gonna be able to pass lead triangle outside to the left for a one play touchdown or a big gain now there's also some other reads to this play the stick the the, the corner route the stock corner is actually really good you can throw it a little early uh, and uh, if it's not cover two, and sometimes even when you run versus cover two, you can throw it over the top of the cloud. So if you throw it and I possession catch it so that if I get hit, I don't drop the ball. Now, if they're not really close to you when you throw it, you can catch it normal and then take it up the field. But you're going to see that even triangle is open on this play too, but I just wanted to throw square and show you guys that you, there's other reads other than just this fade so you don't get locked in on it. So basically, what you're gonna look for initially is gonna see if the fade's open, and what, and then like if you, if, like also if you're getting pressured and you put the running back on an out route to the left, you can throw it to the running back fairly early, and then you, know, you can get some like three or four yards, maybe some more depending on your running back and your stick. So then also you can throw a uh, circle, you can throw it over the top of the cloud or the hard, uh, the purple, uh, or any hard flat or whatever zone is on there. Now, if they're running cloud flats or hard flats to the right, if you put the running back on an out route to the right, uh, I put them on. Um, I have Tom Brady, so I keep putting them on uh, the little sail route. But so if you put him, see, see how I'm just. I wanted to show you the replay here. Why it happened? I got shedded. But basically, what's going to happen if he runs hard flats or cloud flats? Uh, is that the running back will kind of suck him down. They're going to go to guard him. Now, the hard, cloud flat won't suck down as hard, but this is a hard flat here. So he's going to try. You see how he went down, and basically he leaves circle wide open. You can just throw it regular with no pass lead and possession catch it on the sideline. So uh, you have a couple options on this play. Like, again, uh, just put circle on a post, triangle on a fade, streak the tight end. He's going to take the deep blues in the middle third to the, on the right down the field. Because they're gonna, he's a threat basically to them. So, and this is against just random cover three. So he shows you that it works for any cover three circle. Is gonna get open again with the out route on the running back. Now, if you have Kurt Warner, you can put him on a, a a table route or whatever. You know, you can put him on a Texas route, whatever you want. But from what I've experienced, when they run cover three versus this, the table route or the out route to the right is gonna suck down to the hard flat so you can just throw a circle for you know 15 to 25 yards maybe more depending on their if they try and hit stick you and they miss but the two two routes you want to primary focus on is going to be the one play touchdown a triangle square outside you can possession catch it 
or like I said, circle is good. Like, and I rarely throw to the tight end unless they overcommit and they just he leave him wide open. You can possession catch it to the tight end, but I'm not gonna throw it in the video because I tend to not throw it. It just is to take the zones down the field and occupy them. Uh, running back, I'll check down if I'm getting pressure and get like a couple yards. Um, you can put them either way. Uh, the, if you put them to the right, like I said, it's going to help circle get open a little bit better. But if you put them to the left, it's actually going to uh, help you take away their user because once you hit him over going to the hit going to the left a couple times, like for three to five yards, maybe more, he's going to stop using the post and then it's going to open the post up because you don't need to have the zone, but it's more of like it's going to look like the zone is covering it but you could throw it over top of the uh whatever cloud or whatever zone it is or uh, purple or whatever it is you could throw it over it purples guard it but like if you throw it over top of it you can possession catch it on the sideline most of the time especially if they're running linebackers so i'll just throw it if i see a linebacker if it's like a db sometimes i'll just check it down and won't throw it to him unless i have uh uh the out route going to the right so also, um, also you could throw it earlier. Triangle, you could throw it early. Like it, uh, to, the cool thing about Tom Brady is, if you use the Patriots and Regs, it's gonna highlight if he's open. Like it tells you he's open. Like it told you R1 was open immediately, so I could have thrown it to R1. But I know Triangle's gonna get in between the zones because of the motion and the corner out on the left. And the streak is basically the reason on the tight end. You have, like, uh, you need to have the streak basically because if you don't have the streak, I put him on a cross on accident there. You can see that this is where I got sacked because I'm still not used to. Uh, I put, I pressed up on the D pad on accident and I set him on a cross. Messed the whole play up basically. Um, I don't, I don't use Kurt Warner. I just use a slot apprentice. So I've just pushed the wrong button. Uh, you see the running back, I juked the wrong way, but that was like three or four yards that you could have took it up to the right. Um, but like I said, again, if you guys are new and you did like this video, please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up on this video. Like I said, we're going to try and mix in some offensive videos also with uh, some defensive blitzes. You can see circles open, square is going to be open, the running back is going to be open versus cover three. And then you're going to have a one play touchdown potentially to triangle. Which, they're going to try and do some stuff to take it away. That's why there's other routes I wanted to show you get open. So you see see here, down, I don't have any running back route on the right side, but it's still going to be able to throw it over top of them. And I possession catch it just because it, it's going to be more of a contested throw, and they can just hit you from behind. And if you're trying to run down the field, uh, you you know sometimes you might get hit. But you see here, square is open too. Just possession catch it. Go down, get your yards, and then go into the next play. You know, mix in some runs with this and other plays. I'll show you on the channel. But but I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up on it if you did enjoy it. And comment below if you want to interact with me. But am I winning, guys? And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.